So yeah, just um, you know, we're, we're we're missing the we're missing the bracket to go on this side. Uh, that when I don't know, I, I think I've talked about it. We had a little plumbing catastrophe here, and it destroyed the garage in front front of the garage and the ceiling. Well, many things in the in the garage and in in the deconstruction, the the uh, water salvage team that came in, I think, was shoveling stuff out, and I think they I think. I think the, this bracket that had been on the floor with some other odds and ends, um, that bracket right there, I think got thrown away because it, it can't be found anywhere. So yeah, that's on order with Polaris. So this isn't getting finished. Uh, Max, yeah, I'll, I'll go ahead and I, I, I'll tell you, I uh, I find audio clips of things to be pretty inaccurate. Uh, I've got uh, out there on my YouTube, I've got some uh, audio clips of my uh, VMAX with Delcovix on it. It sounds any different than any other bike out there uh, on on YouTube because you know we all, we're recording them with with iPhones and things like that and you know just not a lot of fidelity there. But yeah, I'm happy to do it, so I'll, I'll, I'll put that out there. Meanwhile, you know, the point of the video, I've decided. I, I, I talked a little bit about how I was going to connect this cross bra this cross brace, right, so that I could I could run the the factory uh, looking rear what Polaris calls a bumper. Um, so what I've done is I've put an L bracket down here onto this extra spring hanger that is never used. We already had this tab up top, right? So all you need then is this, right? That's an inch and a half by, uh, well, I think three sixteenths, six and a half inch long. And, um, and bing, bang, boom, that'll mount up uh, here into the tabs. Screw in there, and now I've got a now I've got a solid uh, now I've got a solid plate, you know, here and, and here. Now I've got a solid plate. I can either bolt or I'll probably weld uh, that cross bracket on it, you know, right in between the two exhaust pipes. And then it's just a question again of a question again of of raising that up. And I'll have to probably make sure that I clear this that downturn. So it may have to be up a little bit, a quarter inch something. We'll fit that up when I've got the bracket, which is why this part of the project is going a little slow. So that's what that looks like. It's the last part of the muffler prop. Well, and then I got to put the, the spark resters in. I'll put those in tonight. The uh, second spark rester arrived today. Uh, where was it yesterday? I forget. So yeah, we'll get that. Uh, we're getting close to getting this buttoned up. There you go. The latest update.